Displaced people of Fadan Atakar community in Kaura, local government area of Kaduna State, have appealed to the Kaduna State government to help them get over the shock from last Saturday's attack on the village by unknown gunmen. The attack has displaced about 10,000 indigents of the community from their homes. Grief. Mourning and hopelessness can best describe the mood of these people who were sacked from their ancestral home by unknown government on Saturday, March the 30th, 2013. The paramount ruler of the community condemned the attack, saying members of the community have lived peacefully with their neighbors over the years. Something must be done to dislodge these people so that my people can go back to the hill. The farming season is fast approaching, and if they continue to live as refugees around here, definitely a bigger problem will be in the pipeline. With their houses completely razed down, the villagers have become refugees in their own land. Government will see how they do so that people will come together. We are all ones, even the uh, Muslim people and the Christian, we are all ones. So it's not good to do this, uh, things like this. Mm, though we, they normally bring food for us, but you can't eat it and satisfy the way you normally eat in your house and satisfy. The government should come and help us because we don't have places to go and sleep. All our food stuff born, our animal, domestic animal born, and we don't have houses to go and sleep. Expressing sadness over what he called man's wickedness to his fellow man, Governor Mukhtar Yero, who cut short his trip outside the country to visit the displaced persons and those in the hospital, described the attack as uncalled for. This is an incident that was uh, uncalled for because whoever did this, he wasn't even fair to himself because there is no way you can come to a community and just decide uh, to kill people or to burn their places, either their residences or their places of worship. Although government has promised to assist the victims to get back on their feet and do everything possible to avert a reoccurrence of such incidents, the people are demanding that an urgent arrangement be made for their immediate return and rehabilitation as a condition for normalcy in the affected areas. <laughs>